Hi, it's Penny here from Being Mrs C and today we're going to look at another game from the Play and Learn range that was put out by Ravensburger. So today we've got Ready, Set, Count, which is a game age, aimed at ages 3 to 6 years old um, and you can have one or two players um, with this game. So if you look inside the box at what we have in here. So to start off with, these are the cards that we have in this game. So as I think you can probably just see if I get rid of the reflections. Um, there's one of these for each number, numbers 1 to 10. Um, and you've got, um, kind of comes in several parts, so I'll pop it out of the, um, the outer bit here and do that. So each bit comes in four parts. So you've got the bit at the bottom, which is the picture piece. Um, and then across the top, you've got three more sections. So you've got a written numeral. You've got how that number would look on a dice, on a pair of dice, die. Um, and you've also got how many fingers that would be, which is quite a different way of doing things. So seven fingers in that case. So as I say, you've got all those for the numbers from one up to ten. And you might notice that the numbers um, over five are all coloured blue, and five and below are all coloured yellow. Um, the other thing that you have in the box there is this special little dice. So what you've got on here is different symbols. So if I can just try and get that so you can see it. You've got what's there is the hand si symbol. Um, so suggesting that you're looking at the um, part of the jigsaw puzzle, which is the hands with the showing numbers of fingers. You've got two of those. You've also got a normal dice symbol on there. And you've also whoops, got numbers on there. So one, two, three. Um, so the idea is you can play this game in two different ways. You could have a single player version where a child is just given one of the sets of cards and they're told to they're given the picture card bit and they're told to go away and find the other one. So find the correct number of fingers, find the correct number and find the correct dice picture to correspond with the number of um, animals being shown in the picture. The other way you could do it is you could hand out the big pictures um, and you could have two or maybe more players actually um, and then you put the other three pieces just down on the table everyone takes it in turns to roll the dice and then depending on which symbol they roll they then have to go and pick up one of the corresponding cards that fits with their picture there. Um, so it's quite a it's a relatively simple game but it's quite compact but very very good for learning all the different ways in which you represent numbers um, and I'm hoping that this will be ideal for Master C to practice out to practice some of his numbers as he does at the moment so he's quite good at counting to 10 so we'll put this into practice and see how he gets on thanks very much for watching if you want to subscribe then make sure you click down below and i'll also leave a link down below as to where you can buy this game on amazon thanks very much bye